It's a good question. This person asks, have you covered the difference between a hard link and a soft link? The answer is no, I have not officially done it. I may have done it randomly in a video here or there. I don't remember, um, but I want to make like an actual long form video going over the difference, showing some differences, showing how we can create them, what they look like in the file system, blah, blah, blah. I have an analogy in my head that I was going to use. I can show that creating hard links is like creating multiple pointers to the same piece of data in a C program, whereas creating, you know, soft links would be... It gets very confusing, and I realized, I was like, oh, I can explain this easily with pointers. And I was like, oh, wait, people struggle with pointers, so maybe I, I might go a different route. Um, but no, I haven't covered the difference between a hard link and a soft link. Um, long story short, a directory has a list of file names, and they point to the inode data, and the inode has all the metadata about a file, and then that points to the file contents. So when you have multiple hard links, that means a directory or multiple directories have multiple different file names that both point to the same inode. That's important there. So the inode actually keeps track of how many things are linked to it. So an inode itself knows, like, it'll say number of links four if there are four hard links to it. Most files you encounter in your system will have one link because there's just one file pointing to one inode. If you look at slash, the root directory, go look at the number of hard links to that. It's probably going to be two because dot and dot dot both point to slash the root of your file system. So that's kind of a cool little nifty trick. A soft link or a sim link is totally different. It is its own file. It's a special type of file and it references a path by name, by path name. So because of this, a soft link or a sim link can point anywhere. It could point to a file that doesn't exist. It could point to a file that's mounted on a different file system. A hard link, you can only hard link files on the same file system. There are very strict restrictions around it. Um, so that's a quick synopsis, but no, I do plan on doing a long form video where I cover the difference fully.